What's up, everybody? How you doing? This is Max Boogie from Wall Street. We got week 14 of my man Quincy Blunt playing middle linebacker for the Atlanta Falcons, man. But I do have some big news, man. It's Christmas Eve right here. Hopefully, I can get it up on Christmas Eve. So, happy holidays to uh, everybody that celebrates a holiday in uh, December. But I did want to do something like a connected careers. It's It's been brought back up to my attention by uh this guy this man named uh athletic gamer I, I watched some of his videos and he has some real nice videos he really gives you the full experience like of the all his careers i know he has a couple of running backs and uh, i'll probably leave his channel in the description but he brought up the idea to me that i should probably start a uh connected career online with some people i, I know i'm gonna start it with him if i if nobody like wants to uh, join it either I know one person he left another comment say he would join but I know that if anybody if it, nobody else wants to join I just start it up because it doesn't matter if it's going to be full or if it's not going to be full I just know I'm a, I'm going to have this career playing online with people I'm just posting the videos uh, <laughs> but um if you do want to join man leave your game attack in the comments it's only going to be a player franchise, and it's just going to be, you know, for fun, upload some games to YouTube. It'd be nice, you know what I'm saying? I'm thinking about making a safety. Um, I had an idea of playing with a safety in Madden a couple, I think a couple months ago, actually. But I never really came around to making a whole story about it. And I had ideas of playing wide receiver, but I don't want to play now. No wide receiver. It's either going to be a safety or... Probably like the D-line or something like that. That's what I was thinking of. And I'm probably going to end up choosing to be the uh, to choosing to be the safety. Because the D-line is it's alright. I played it in NCAA. But Madden is totally different. I, I just don't like how the D-line is, is here. Like you got to press a button to get off a block. like, And you can't get off the block until you press the button. And the button takes the timer. And all this other stuff, man. Maybe I will. Maybe I won't. And like you know, what I'm saying they both safety and D line has its good and its bad. So um, leave a comment if you think I should play D line or you think I should play a safety in this connected careers online. And if you do want to join, leave your game tag or send me a message. Um, it says Xbox on the Xbox One. Um, leave, leave me leave a comment or send me a message with your game tag in it. And I, I I just invite you to it. I'm gonna probably start it up around. Uh, well, January 1st, because some people might be on vacation or something. They might not see the video until, like, January 1st or something when they get back. So, I'm going to start it up around then. So, you got a whole couple of days. A couple of days to come in and say, yeah, I want to join. Yeah, I don't want to join. Or something like that. But it is only players, though. It's a players league. And that's how we're going to be doing it. So, uh, this game right here, though, we're going up against the Green Bay Packers. You know what I'm saying? Atlanta Falcons, we out here. It's in the second half. And the Atlanta Falcons offense only scored six points. That's two field goals. But luckily, though, the defense, led by Quincy Blunt, only allowed the Packers offense to score zero points with Aaron Rodgers as their quarterback. Now, we've been trying to hit Aaron Rodgers this whole game, man. We've been blitzing a lot. We already know we're going to stop the run. And we did get a lot of sacks. We was really beating up Aaron Rodgers this game. And... The score shows it. Second half was zero points. I'm not sure that ever happened in real life in the NFL. Hold the Packers to zero points in the second half. But they do end up end up converting this first down right here. So we still on the field with Quincy Blunt. I started to jam the wide receivers a little bit more. I know I didn't show it, but actually one of those plays, I got a uh, offsides call because I was a little bit too close. But you know what I'm saying? I didn't really need to show it because the play didn't really have any meaning to it. It was on a third down it was a third and long i think and i got off sides and they still ended up not getting it but aaron Rodgers is starting to make throws to the sidelines i don't know how jordy nelson came up with that catch put two feet down and we get another sack though this game and the last game we both had both games had a whole bunch of sacks in it you know what i'm saying no homo but we always stop the run and we get sacks occasionally you know what I'm saying? Maybe it's on. Maybe it's on this game. Maybe it's going to be off next two games or something like that. But they do try to screen because, you know, he's Aaron Rodgers. He's going to notice that we blitzed him a lot. He audible to the screen to Eddie Lacy. They get the touchdown. And it puts us down by one now. They scored one touchdown and we're down by one. 
the offense really has to kick start kicking up, man. We can't go to no Super Bowl or make it far in the playoffs without no offense, you know. Oh, uh, we coming out. We always gonna stop the run. It seemed like every game we stopped the run because OC and Croy Beerman is on the edge. They set the edge, and Quincy is in the middle. And you know you're not gonna get past Quincy Blunt coming up the middle, but. Quincy Blunt making the tackle to save the first down right there. Had a couple of players. A couple of players hit him in the back. They ended up kicking the field goal. Missed it somehow. I thought I was going to at least try to get a chance to block it. They missed it completely. So, Falcons offense got the ball. We ended up kicking the field goal to put us up by two points. We got to keep them out of field goal range. And they got three timeouts. It's two minutes left. And on the 24-yard line. Come on now, this this situation right here is crazy. Almost faking the jam right there. No pressure on Aaron Rodgers, but it's pressure on this wide receiver though. Getting smacked by Quincy Blunt, man. Quincy Blunt is wilding right now. I see him jumping. He was dancing and forcing the fumble, man. It was a crazy hit. Probably one of the biggest hits. I had two big hits this game. I didn't have that much tackles though, but I had two big hits. And this this tackle right here. Definitely was a game changer. We saw him catch it, turn, square them up, hit the ball loose, and that's how we do it. Thought the game was going to be over after that, though. Thought the Falcons would have been smart and just ran out the clock. But I guess the Packers defense said, oh, no, nah, we're not going to let y'all run out the clock. They ended up scoring. The only time they scored was in the fourth quarter and when we didn't need them to, really. But Aaron Rodgers is going to try to come down the field as we trying to sit in this coverage but you know we, we can't do that we have to send blitzes against Aaron Rodgers so we do the Quincy blitz again I'm bouncing off of bloggers and he finds a wide open man downfield didn't score though they're on the 23 yard line 16 to 7 we come in almost gets the sack when he gets the ball away gain of nine on the play third down we trying to stop him right here man we bring the blitz again trying to fight off Eddie Lacy and unfortunately we can't do it now they're driving down the field too easy. So, we like, you know what? We got to stop blitzing. We stop blitzing going to cover two. Somehow, he's open in the flats and just easily runs in. You know what I'm saying? We was in cover two. The corner should have been over there. But you know what? It didn't matter anyway. I don't even know why he hyped up. They ain't win the game. Even if they went for two, they wasn't going to win. So, game is 16 to 14, man. Had to kick up on Aaron Rodgers right quick, man. We hit him about, I don't, I'm not sure how many times we hit him to show the stats. Not sure if I sorted it by sacks for the Atlanta Falcons or not. But you see here, man, the only only scoring in the, there was no scoring in the second and third quarter. Two field goals in the first, and there was two touchdowns and a field goal in the fourth quarter. Which is really crazy, man. Defense on the Atlanta Falcons in Madden is is on the upside right now. We just gotta get the offense to play consistently. You know what I'm saying? It's like the opposite in the real life though. The offense is really doing good and defense is not playing consistently enough for us to keep on winning. But hopefully we do beat the Panthers this week. But if you do want to join that connected careers online, the player player franchise, leave your comment, leave your game tag in the comments below. Send me a message on Xbox Live, M A X X B O O G I E. You know that's my game tag. But this video is coming to an end. So always remember in the street we trust, I'm out.